Hello everybody, Skylanders Zion here, and welcome to yet another first portal drop. This time, we've got another sensei, and, well, let's just get right into it, I guess. This time, we've got a new inbox chopscotch, and I know what you're thinking, you're gonna unbox it, right? No. Like, okay, finding inbox Skylanders nowadays is not very easy. So, I'm not- I'm going to try to get one of each game, like one new inbox each game. I've already got Bronze Roller Brawl for Superchargers, now I've got Chopscotch for Imaginators. Any future Imaginators character I get that's new inbox, I'll probably unbox that. Any future Superchargers character I get that's inbox, I'll probably unbox that. But, Chopscotch is staying in, just as like a little collector's piece. But, let's get right into the gameplay. As you can see, I just finished recording the, um, Easter Sensei video, so let's go. This ghoul is here to take your imaginators to school. Level 51, we've only got nine more senseis to get. And, okay, she's level one, that's good. That's good for us. And let's get right into the gameplay. Nice to see you again, Skylander. And it looks like you're here for a rumble. Nice to see that, too. Oh, I pressed the wrong button. Well, well, well. Nice to see you again, Skylander. Yeah, um, Buzz, hurry up. There you go. Ready. Let's get rumbling. Okay, so Chopscotch, what can I say about her? She was a Wave 1 Sensei that was originally revealed by, I believe Family Gamer TV was the first person to ever upload gameplay of Chopscotch. And she is a really fun character. She was my original favorite in Imaginators, and honestly, while that doesn't hold up to this day, I still do enjoy playing as her. So as you can definitely see by now, she's got two main things. She's got her chops, and she's got a spin attack, which, for a smasher, they're very basic things, but she's still really fun in the way that she uses them differently. Like, Peñata obviously is all about slamming the lollipop, Tri-Tip is all about swinging the mace, and the last smasher being Chopscotch, obviously all about chopping. I never got this version because I have candy-coated Chopscotch, and I always thought that it was the better version. I still kind of do, but this figure, from what I can tell because I'm leaving it in box, it looks really nice. Like overall, the details on it just look so nice. The skull especially looks very well painted, I just believe that it's a great figure. And Imaginators overall has some great figures, so it's a shame that it was the game that they ended off on, because it would have been interesting to see what else they had in store. And we're already level 4. Um, anything? Can we get the upgrade yet? No. Okay. But, yeah, Chopscotch overall is a really fun character, and as simple as she is, just... Great design, great gameplay, overall, pretty great. I'm excited to have this version finally because, like I mentioned, I only need 9 more senseis now. So this might be one of the first games that I have a complete collection, variants and all. Which, like, I have a complete Spyro's Adventure collection, but I'd like to think that Imaginators is more to brag about. And let's just jump on this guy. There you go. Let's get that victory. And we're going to be able to get the upgrade now, which is pretty nice. Skylander, that was awesome. And I'm talking about the good kind of awesome here, too. Although, now that I think about it, I guess there really is no other kind. Well, anyway, nice job. 
Okay. So, let's actually just get the upgrade. I'm not opening that chest on camera. Um, it's our third attack, which it, you can read what it says, but we can now throw our head at enemies. Which, this is a really weird attack, but for the undead element, it's fitting. And, I don't know, I just... I really like Chop Scotch as a character. And, like I said, she was my original favorite. So, of course, I'm going to give her some respect. So, yeah, that's about all I've got to show for Chop Scotch. Thank you guys for tuning in, and tune in next week for... I actually don't know what's coming next week. Um, This video is the first one I've recorded that doesn't have an upload date scheduled, so, uh... If you're seeing this, I just didn't know what to upload this week, and... Yeah, um, peace out. <laughs>